I mean, I don't know how different it is when compared to, um, I don't know how different it is when compared to For the More Towards 5. Your next race takes place in heavy rain at Sebring International Raceway. Racing on a wet track poses several challenges. Tires lose grip easier during cornering. Braking distances are longer, and deep puddles accumulate, causing a risk of hydroplaning. Alright, yeah. But I don't know how different it is when we compare it to Forza Motorsports 5. Um, but I would assume, like, the main... like, like I'm, I'm just guessing here, but I think, like, the main difference between 5 and 6 are... Uh, it's how, you know, it's like the, how the physics are, how cars feel, the rain, uh, all, but all these upgrades that I said already. But I think what basically means to the laundry was, is the graphics maybe. I don't know, like, that's like the only thing I could ever, I could think of why 6 is better, is 6 is similar to, f uh, 5, or 6, yeah, 6 is similar to 5 is the graphics probably. But again, I want to know, I don't have it. But yeah, you know, I'm glad that I skipped it because this game just... It blows me out of the water right? coming from uh, f coming from four. Okay, we're gonna get these guys on experience because these guys are tough. Oh, it's saved. Good. Um, yeah, let's go on experience unless they just unless we wreck them. All right, let's do this. Right, so you see, I showed I showed you that I can do above average. I can do above average avatars. Just I need a car that I uh, that I tune with better. That I, uh, you know, that I am better with. Also, starting in first also helped that last race. Alright, let's do this. Remember, we're in the rain and we're on the right. Oh, well, in the driver's seat anyway. Did I break his lights? Can you break lights in this game? If you run, if you run into them hard enough? Oh, but they're still fine, everybody. Remember, they can now mess up, or at least now they're more common mess up. Ah, I didn't know it's oh, our first we wanted a long time. Well, you know, in the race or two. Okay, stop it now. There we go. Wait, are you, I was using a completely different cars, both Americans, or two of them American. I don't think Lois is American. Oops, damn. Mud, or wood, dirt, and the helping. Okay, we're in fourth, yeah, and these guys are not too far ahead. They're in, they're in Nissan. Don't go in the water. I get in the water anyway. But I saw, well, yeah, I kind of thought I was going to get in the water, and then B, I actually saw myself pull in that direction. Well, and again, if I haven't said this already, be you know, if, you, if you're going to get this game, I would have just having um, rumbling turned on. Because it does really give you the feel of dry. It does really give you, oh, I missed that turn. Yeah, I'm used to the, um, I'm used to the Mustang with its epic turning, or with it with its epic uh, brakes. And if I oh no oh no we're gonna spin out no we're not we're, yeah we're just staying gaining speed when we got in the mud yeah we definitely you know what we definitely miss with some turn brakes on this thing. We gotta start tuning our vehicles. The next race we're gonna do that, or if I have to restart this race we're gonna do that then. Come on, turn. Yeah, okay, yeah. No, wait, yeah. Yeah, you know what? We're, yeah, let's go. Let's go get these brakes turned, tuned. Because I really, really wish I could turn while braking. And you know what? Yeah, let's. Yeah, we're doing good. We're doing good. But, you know, we're going to do a whole lot better if we turn up, if we tune our brakes so they're much uh, easier to turn with. Uh, I want the tire pressures. Not gearing, not alignment, not roll bars, not springs, not dampening, not zero brakes. Yes. I want pressure to go down. Uh oh. Um. Uh, we need racing brakes. That's not good. Uh, I wonder, I, I forget if in both the ones what's for, you need, I don't think you need, I didn't think you need upgraded brakes in order to tune them. But yeah, we need upgrade brakes to tune them, so that's, that was unfortunate, I should stay in the race then. Oh, 
Oh, no, no. Oh, well. Oh, come on, guys. Ah, oh, okay, yeah, that's... Yeah, that wall. We hit, we, we touched the wall and it just, you know, it just ate us. It just grabbed us and pulled us next to it. Let's try that again. I wish it was qualifying so we didn't have the place in the back or in the middle, which is worse. Or actually, you know, eh. Back or, back or middle, what's worse? Uh, probably the middle. And probably the back, actually. Yeah, I'm pretty sure in Fuzzle Mode Switch 4, there was only like 12 racers in a race. Just select between these guys, there we go. Much better story this time. But don't mess it up until we can start rewinding. Oh, yes! Yes! I got when the, the dirt bite didn't really matter. I didn't really miss with him that did it. Uh, bonk. Remember, bonk off these guys, bonk off these guys, there we go. We have simulation damage on, but these cars are resilient. Oh, that guy is unfortunate, he's in the rain. And he's in the convertible. Sure, he's wearing an entire racing suit and a helmet, so... Like, it matters to him if he's in the rain or not, but still. Oh, it's getting the interior of his car wet, so, yeah. Going fourth. Oh, uh, where's the where's the turn? There it is. Bounce off this guy. Bam! Sorry, sorry, sorry. I had to bounce off you, buddy. He's gonna be mad at me now. But yeah, we're in third. That's all. That's all I want. If we want money, we just play the dumb free races. I like average AI or above average AI with the uh, Fords or the uh, Lotus. You see the water causing me to go off track. Oh no. There we go. I think I was I thought I, I I didn't think I was gonna make that turn, so I had my uh thumb on Y. Ah nope. <sighs> Again, I wish I could just press A whenever I wanted so I didn't have to, uh, so I could just press it wherever I wanted to restart at, or right when I want, right where I wanted to rewind at, or end rewinding at. That'd be really nice, and I wish you could rewind from the beginning of the, from the two seconds into the race to two seconds before the race ends. That'd be really nice. But that might just be too hard to do, that might just, might, but not, but that may not be possible to program for some reason. Because I haven't done it yet, so. It's like, so I can only assume. Yeah, it's rain, man. It's really hard. It's, it's very hard to see the track. I'm a, I don't mind the rain. I don't mind the rain on the windscreen, but the rain, but the rain on the track really matters. Hides where it is. I think we have a, we have a, uh, no, we have a mini map in the bottom left. So I mean, it's a tiny mini map, but still, it's a mini map. Oh, we have to start breaking, I think. Oh, oh, ooh, ooh. Yo, I hit one of the, no, those, those puddles actually got me. There we go. And they're not catching them. They're not making mistakes and they just, and they're just faster than us. Oh, that's too early. That's one thing. Yeah, actually, yeah, that's too early as well. Yeah, and I can't see the tracks. I'm looking at the mini-map, and I'm just not attuned to the mini-map just quite yet. Average yeah, strength. There we go. Hey, at least we're making that turn now. messed up why uh, I don't why am I not making this turn in the pole and I see I first why in the right in the same spot yet it rewinded more that time yeah it's weird how the system works but at least it has the system unlike some games which don't because they think they don't because he will because they say they don't want it to be cool and all but yeah I mean 
I do prefer rewinds over anything else because rewinds are just simply they allow you to make mistakes and not completely lose for it. Like if you make a mistake at the end, instead of having to restart uh, like uh, like a 20 minute long race, you can just... How did I get that turn? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. How did I, how, I broke I broke I broke that much. How did I not get the turn? Or braked. I don't know when I when I think of it, I think I should be saying broke. I don't know why I think I should be saying broke. Cause I'm pretty sure it's break, but yeah. Let's just say it's be interesting. But yeah, like I was saying, yeah, some games like Project Cars don't don't have uh, rewinds because they say that. Because people say, oh, that's not simulation. I, I don't want to have rewinds. Or you don't have to use them if you don't want to. And in Forza, you can turn them off to get more money. So, what's the problem? And for people like me who uses them, because we like to... Because people like me like to um, learn vehicles. They don't want to just play hours upon hours of uh, test tracks in order to figure out how a vehicle works. So, yeah. And also, and also, if there's bugs in the game or just, or just AI being jerks, you don't have to... You know, you don't have to worry about that, I and mean, we probably we probably should have rewinded there. We rewinded before that because we are in sport we in fourth with the guys in front of us. I messed up a little bit and that was enough. Actually we could make this turn yeah, sort of. I got no I got any dirt. Here comes the uh here comes the uh, rain on the track. Oh let me set up. I said the guy reset the race because of this guy. This guy comes in out, coming out of nowhere and taking the lead, or taking the third. Come on, turn. Why do they make the mini up so small? Why do they make all of it so small? Is what I want to know. For real, that big TVs. Why do they make it so small? Um, you know this guy. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do here. And so it's and breaking. Oh, oh, water, water, water. Oh, come on, guy. You see how are they doing this? How are they capexing me like this? I'm being, I'm doing a perfect performance, and you know these guys are passing me somehow. I'm doing the exact same thing I, I was when I was passing them, and then they just automatically pass me. Weird. It, you know, ah, oh. yeah. All right, now. Come on, come on. Big money, big money. Oh, that's not big money. That's a Subaru. I wanted the awesome old car thing. There, we'll get you. We'll get you sometime, Brap. Um, we get you what sometime? Yeah, I was thinking water game. You jerk. Then have a spin with an interesting car that I had to commentate on. Come on, game. That would be a jerk. And go. You're in the middle. That's a good. That's a good passing place. Yeah, I think what got me last time was I hit the uh, I hit the dirt. That happened. That's that. That's what got me last time. Well, I wish you could change my braking and make it actually so I can turn, but oh well. I'll come in time. If I can do that with the Ford GT, because it's, you know, it's a supercar, kind of, sort of. Come on, new, new, new. I should have rewind it. No, I'm not, I shouldn't rewind it. No, I'm not. I rewind every single small mistake. No, that's not me. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. As much as I would like to, for some odd reason, I'm not going to do it. I mean, what's worse? I mean, to you, to you, what's worse? Having to rewind just a small mistake and doing it often, or having to rewind an entire race that's like 20 minutes long? Especially if you're watching a video of someone doing that who does long commentary and doesn't edit stuff, or doesn't edit out every single defeat and, or, uh, or death. Like some people do. 
Exactly. What do you think? Ah, uh, come on. Do I have to restart this race? We just need to get, we just need to get off to a good start. I mean, we are going against inexperienced guys, right? And you know what? Let's just rewind. We are going against inexperienced guys. Wait, did I say that? Uh, these guys aren't really making mistakes. They are not acting like inexperienced drivers or inexperienced uh, driver tars. Yeah, I did. Uh, that's the pro that's your problem. It, it did say that time, right? I'm. What's with this? What's with the? I wonder what's with the uh, menus in this game and not saving. Cause I swear I saved. Yeah, I pressed A last time. I saved. Why didn't it? Ah, uh, I don't know. I have to check the footage because I'm pretty sure I saved that. I'm pretty sure I saved it, but that's the problem. I, mean, I would be I would be doing above average if it wasn't the first effect I was recording. And these guys are really good. I mean, we we almost, we got, almost got in third with, with above average. I mean, with average, but unfortunately, uh, I just made a small mistake, and that was it. There we go. Oh, the water. And we're just as a fact. The, wind, the water adds that one element that makes things a whole lot different, a whole lot different, a whole lot different than a uh, normal race, which is really nice. It uh, adds a whole lot more difficulty and randomness that you just don't have otherwise. Oh yes, you guys are. Bonk. Sorry. Oh, see that guy drove off the track. Yeah, he's, yeah, this is the the sign of it, of inspir of the these this that is the telltale sign of an exper of an inexperienced Dravatar. or in or of an ex inexperienced difficulty is people making mistakes which is what the normal difficulty was on uh, in for the most part 3 and 4 which is interesting then that in a second Yeah, this should be called like the default difficulty for for the most what's foreign of inexperience, because it is the same difficulty. Oh, and the water caused me to run into that guy. Jerk water. Hey, water. If you're hydroplaning, the whole the pools of water just misses with your traction. It makes it make that makes it a whole lot more tractiony going to the side. So she on higher speeds. And we're gonna initiate a pass. If the water doesn't mess us up. There we go. There we go. No new. Now see even on the in the experience, these guys are just have these guys just have better cars than me. Even though I got an even though I got a Nissan Fair Lady Z, they're still good they still have better cars than me, or at least they feel like they have better cars than me. Oh, ah, I wasn't paying attention. I had a lot of concentration of less than a half second, and then bam, I, I lose my, uh, I lose a corner. Uh, see, you just don't have that in both of sports four. In both of sports four, you got, you can play, play an entirely different game and do a race and win a race. However, in this game, however, you just cannot do that. It doesn't work. You just have to be, you have to concentrate 110 percent, or else you will lose, especially in different conditions of race environments you know like rain or or rain or the night no, no you don't I mean I guess the thing is the fair lady has turning and braking well that well uh, everyone else has uh, well he probably has acceleration and top speed and where's the brake this guy? yeah right here oh hello yeah, that's not gonna do. He does that. Oh no, it will do because we can pass him in the turn, right? Because we can turn a whole lot better. Under a lot better. There we go. We could spin this guy on a complete trick, but we're not gonna do that. Old me might do that, but new me, no, I don't do that. I don't do that kind of stuff. Um. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Get off the wall! Get off the wall! It's not the wall's fault, actually. It's the whole. There's a whole bunch of puddles on that one side of the track. That's the real problem. It's outside of the main track. There's a ton of 
tunnels that just increase the friction and just make me go into the wall. That's the problem. I don't know if that's don't know if that makes sense or not. I mean I know it makes complete sense so I said it or at least it should. Uh oh no. Come on. Uh I, we lost first, but I'm not gonna restart. I mean I'm gonna hit Y. It's tempting, but I'm not gonna do it. No, we're still far ahead from the, from the other guys. And we still can catch up to this guy. And then break. Ah, nope. Man, why can't you just get breaking in this thing, right? I mean, I, A, it's raining, which it probably doesn't help matters. Uh, a, I mean, A, I guess that's it. A, it's raining. It doesn't help matters. That's, that's all that needs to be said. It's It's raining. And the rain adds iron element, because, you know, like, you can stop sometimes, you can't. Why did I lose all that speed there? I mean, am I, I don't know why I lost all that speed there. I'm going to say, I'm, I don't know. Okay, I guess I do know. I might win the grass. I might win kind of off the track. I might just lost all my speed in that turn for some reason. Oh, no. Oh, we got a slid on that one. Got hydroplaned. I wonder why they decided to make the rain so, you know, so, so epic. So overpowered. Instead of making kind of like real life where it's, you know, like it could get you into trouble, but if you're, if you're, no, if you know what to do, it doesn't do anything. However, in Fortnite World Sports 6, it's a random element. Even if you know what you're doing, like I do, it just still is a problem. And it's still, it's still the problem. Yeah, I really need to get those dumb racing brakes so I can actually turn. Because, yeah. Why, I wonder why they made it so you have to get racing brakes in order to uh, tune your brakes now. I'm pretty sure it wasn't like that in Fuzz Most Sports 4. So yeah, I wonder why they changed it. I mean, maybe they're, like, the argument is like the stock brakes are unmodifiable. And the racing brakes actually you can modify them or something. I'm trying to break and turn, it's not working. And that's time, but we're almost we're almost off the race. Sure we lost on first, but I rather I rather not rewind when I don't really need to than rewind and uh, just be a jerk. And rewind and just be that way. Okay, we got these guys and we don't have the best acceleration or top speed, but hey, they all they're all the way back there and we're all the way up here. We're a long way to go to get us. There we go. Perfect. All right. And we can handle the reading the map now and just my breaking distance on it. Oh, no. We got to break on that a little bit. Yeah, it's probably because of the water we just couldn't turn. All right. Prepare for a break in three, two, one. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, we did it. All right. We beat this race. Took two seconds. It took two sessions, but we beat it. And lowering difficulty, but hey, we still made lots of money doing it. Alright. Showcase events give you a chance to drive some of the world's fastest cars. Alright. In events that highlight what makes each car special. Aw, oh, yes, Indy Cars. You have unlocked your first showcase event. Alright. There are many kinds of showcase events, from autocross to passing challenges, organized into separate groups. All right. You have earned access to this showcase group. Select it to learn more about these exciting events. All right. The motorsport pyramid is rocky and steep, and very few drivers make it to the very top. Only they know what it's like to race at Le Mans, or Indianapolis or Bathurst in cars tailor-made for the occasion. In these showcases, you can get one step closer to experiencing these races and glimpse into the life of a professional racing driver. Here you'll drive the world's greatest race cars on some of the most famous circuits in international racing. All right. These events are all part of the Race Driver Experience Group. 
Select this event and we'll enter you in your first showcase race. Right, let's do this in the car. And you know what? We'll do this next time, can I? Back out. Actually, we'll continue. Oh, we are going in. Your next race will be at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. The highest capacity sports venue in the world with 400,000 seats. Alright. Oh, uh, you know what? We can do one more race, I think. Okay, we can back out here actually, yeah. I got me some um. IndyCar, America's ultimate single seater championship, in which cars must somehow remain grounded while doing 230 miles per hour on a banked oval. Mm. So aerodynamics is king, which is why these look unlike any other single seaters in the world. In fact, every team must use a standard Dallara chassis, but can choose between a Chevrolet or Honda engine. All right. Um, you know, let's do it. Right, put it on above average. Yeah, let's do it. It's 138. I mean, 136 right now. I should be uh, recording World Warfare. I should have been recording World Warfare. Oh, well. Alright, let's do this. This shouldn't be that fat. It shouldn't be that. Uh, it shouldn't be that uh, slow of a race. This would be quick as fuck if I can get at it. Well, wait. Oh. All right, here we go. And some of average guys. Yeah, we're just gonna. This is a test race. Right? See if we can actually uh, get in a good position and stay there. Oh wow, this thing. Yeah, this thing handles much better than the uh, Formula One car does in the Lotus. Oh, bonk! Then we wind that. I think it really mattered much, but yeah, rewind that. I tried move. I'm trying to turn. Oh, that guy. Oh, that guy's a jerk. He's in my way. Come on. You know. I gotta get used to how this thing turns, because it's different. It, it's different how it turns. It's, it really is a different feeling. It's sensitive, but also it does big sweeping turns. There we go. And then, like the uh, Lotus, which does not big sweeping turns, but just fast. Quick ones. All right, going one third already. So yeah, we're above average is the way to go. And basically, above average just depends on what car I'm driving, and yeah, that's it. Oh, where is the guy in first? Oh, he's way up there, but we're going past him. Guys, you know what? I can go fast in turns. Uh, we're no drive train is damaged. I love that I can actually see what's damaged you now. Unlike in the, uh, unlike in four, where you had to bring up the, you had to bring up the uh, debug color to figure out what the, uh, to figure out how you, to figure out what's damaged. But it, the, how this thing handles at, so, at high speed is a little, it's a little weird. Oh, it, oh he took up the end of the steam. Well, that's not a smart thing to do, sir. Oh, we are two laps and we are in first. Oh yeah, I could do higher. I could I, I could do higher difficulties, but my main difficulty is above average, and my second main difficulty is um, the long haul, and my second main difficulty is uh, inexperienced if I have to. Or my third one, and my second one, and then my second one's average. Oh, yeah, we're way ahead. Any of these five brakes yet? It's been letting go of the gas. Uh, 
and it just just relax as we're going as we're going 100 I was going 220 miles an hour I mean, you, may you may notice something in the uh, opening in the intro to this race uh, and that is the starting line and the finish line of Indianapolis is a bunch of bricks you no know, it's a very thin it's a very thin brick uh, brick line and that's and then and then that's what and, and the Indianapolis racetrack has always been or was originally an entire brick track back when it was a, when that when it was first made and after and after it was first made it's just been every you know like every couple of decades it's slowly thinking grow bricks as bricks for racing especially with NASCARs and Indy cars and Formula One cars going over 200 miles an hour very sensitive uh, with very sensitive um, no, with a high chance of flipping, it's not a good idea to have a very bumpy surface such as bricks and mortar. So that's why the tr that's why they repaved it in concrete and tarmac, um, and that's why there's only just this thin silver brick left as we're going to see in a second. There it is. See right there. You can pause the video there if you really want to see it. Um, they, they they kept that on there just because it's the classic Indianapolis uh, raceway. That you know, like Indianapolis is. Also called the brickyard, you know, just dull bricks. Uh, so they kept it there just because they could. Uh, and um, yeah, just fun fact. It's the history for you. Now there was actually a um, a three a, a DS and a Wii game. Like in the Anapsis 500, something or other, uh, where basically you could play, you, you play through a bunch of, um, you play through a bunch of arrows of the of the Indianapolis, of the Indianapolis Raceway, from basically its creation to modern day. I never really got that far in the game, but yeah, you get, but but uh, but what I'm trying to get, what I'm trying to get at is in that game you can actually see uh, the changing of the uh, the changing of the track being, you know, being from being the making seeing the bricks get uh, thinner and thinner. Uh, so yeah. That, that's a pretty interesting game. Also, you can play your crit crew and stuff like that. Pretty interesting. Probably still out there somewhere. Probably on Amazon or or or, 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 or GameStop. Now nah, prepare for e break. And wait for it. Wait for And no. Oh, do early, too early. This thing doesn't e break. This thing just turns. Oh, oh well, we're gonna pay for that damage. Are we gonna pay for that damage? No, we're not gonna pay for that damage. <laughs> no wave it. Yeah. Oh, a million would be nice. No one of these cars, not really. A million, million. Oh, not this guy. Uh, but the, it's fine, I guess. I guess we only damaged the. Uh... You have completed your first showcase. Race. Yeah. You'll be invited to many more as you continue your career. Now, let's get back to the Challenger series. Alright, well, we'll do that next time. So let's head out. I'll continue the career in a second. In, well, not in, uh, yes, in a second for you if you're watching the playlist. But if you're watching this live, it'll be tomorrow, maybe. If probably tomorrow. You shall see. As I'm having lots of fun with this game. I mean, I guess, that, I guess this is now main, one of my main sequence games. Or it might just be one of my games I do every so often. We'll have to see. Uh, but so far, you guys are really liking it. So I'm definitely making... Uh, for right now, anyway, it's a main sequence game, which means it's gonna be no, which means that for the opening week, it's gonna be the main thing on my channel. Then after the opening week, I'll be, I'll be, um, I'll be interchanging this with, um, with uh, the, with my fall three L, with my fall three LP, my uh, my period LP, and my active aggression playthrough. So yeah, and you know what? Let's head. Uh, let's. Wait, can we just go back? There you go. Yeah, I don't have to go over to the office. I'm gonna just head back to the in between the main menu and the uh, menu, or between the main menu and the tile screen. All right, but anyway, so yeah, thanks for watching. I do appreciate you guys watching on these episodes. It means a lot to me. I'm also gonna have to leave a comment to me what to me what you like to me what you like to me if you're interested in the series. I like what vehicles you want to see next. Tips I'll play. Uh, for the for the more for the six in general. If I'm even offering no tips, give me in the comments for people that do know tip. Oh, and by the way, uh, I, I I figured I'd make these like 30 minute long episodes because they just the game just the game just wants 30 minute long episodes. It it doesn't really go well with 14 minute, which is my normal um, play through uh, uh, play through uh, uh, play through time. 
uh, or just time or just console time anyway. Uh, I, but you know, this is more. This is a let's play anyway. So if I ever wanted to come back, I would not. I, I wouldn't have to record like an hour long session like I do now, or more than an hour long. I, I'll just record like a certain long video if I want to come back and you know I just complete the campaign and just want to come back and have fun, some fun with a new car that I got, in like free mode in free race or something like that. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. And I still might, you know, and if, you know, in the, in the future, because in the future, this is the, because this is the beginning of the gaming season for me. In the future, like, late, like, late, like, mid to late October, when everything starts coming out, I will probably have to put this, um, uh, back, uh, back away and probably make this, you know, hopefully I'll beat the camp, hopefully I'll beat the career mode before then, we'll see. Uh, but I might just have a really long career mode, and I might, it might just have a really long career mode, and I might not be able to beat it in time, uh, of, uh, all the, all, all, of all the new releases, so we'll see, we'll see what happens. Alright, but anyway, so yeah, I guess, see y'all in a second.